Welcome to the CTTP training videos. R.449 Determination of Asphalt Content of Asphalt Mixtures by the Nuclear Method This video demonstrates determining the binder content of asphalt mixtures using a Troxler 3241C nuclear AC gauge. Place the gauge at least 30 feet from other radiation sources. The area around the gauge shall be kept free of hydrogenous materials such as water, plastics, or asphalt during use. Turn on the gauge and allow it to warm up. Set the time to 8 or 16 minutes by pressing the Time button, then press the Yes button. Select option 3 or 4. Start a new background count by pressing the BKG button, then press Yes. Ensure that the chamber is empty. Close and latch the door and press the start key. Move away at least three feet from the gauge during the count. Verify that the new background count is within plus or minus 1% of the previous background count. If so, accept the new background count by pressing yes and record the new background count in the daily log. If the new background count is not acceptable, take additional background counts until the requirement is met. Set the test time to 4, 8, or 16 minutes for field testing. Press the time button and then press the yes button to change the time. Select option 2, 3, or 4. Activate the appropriate calibration by pressing the calib button. Select option 2 for a stored calibration. Select option 1 to scroll through the available stored calibrations or option 2 to enter the calibration number. then press enter. The gauge is now ready for testing. The ready screen shows the time and calibration active in the gauge. Obtain 8,000 to 10,000 grams of a representative portion of the asphalt mixture to be tested. Zero the gauge sample pan. Remove the pan from the scale and fill it half full with the asphalt mixture. Using a scoop, trowel, or spoon, tamp the mixture lightly, including the corners. Next, fill the pan full and tamp lightly, including the corners. Place the sample pan on the scale platform and add or remove asphalt mixture to match the calibration weight within 5 grams. Compress the asphalt mixture with the leveling plate until it is even with the pan rim. Verify that the weight is still within 5 grams of the net calibration weight. Check the temperature of the test sample and verify that it is within 10 degrees Fahrenheit of the calibration temperature. If not, adjust the temperature of the pan by placing it in an oven or allowing the asphalt mix to cool down. Load the pan into the AC gauge and latch the door. Press the Start button to begin the test and move away at least 3 feet. When the test is complete, record the counts and the percent asphalt binder content to the nearest 0.01%. If desired, additional tests may be run on the sample before removing it from the pan. If additional tests are run, report the average values. Determine the moisture content of the asphalt mixture according to ASHTO T329. Subtract the moisture content from the gauge-derived asphalt binder content and report to the nearest 0.1%. Please visit our website at cttp.org for other training videos and modules.